Hello everyone. I hope you guys are doing well. So in this tutorial we are going to learn how we can load in GIF in our application. So let's look into the demo first. So I've created a demo in which this is a GIF and it's playing in our application. So basically GIF is used whenever we have to show some moving images or something like that. And sometimes it's also using in a custom loaders which was the requirement of the client when we are creating any application so i have already created a custom loader so let's look into that also so as i click on this this is a custom loader and it's showing a loading and as a response of api comes it's removes from the screen so after this functionality we after learning how we can load a gif in our application we can move to uh, learn how we can create a custom loader something like that if you like my videos, please don't forget to subscribe my channel to get the cool iOS stuff. Let's create an app. So open an Xcode project, click on single view application, click on next. Uh, just give the name whatever you want to give. GIF loader ing. It's a random name, you can give, choose anything. Be sure the language should be swift. Click on next. Just save where you want to save. Now. Uh, for getting for loading the images we have to import one file uh, for importing that file we have to go through this website to go through this uh, uh, github library which is this is swift gif swift gif and in this library this is an awesome library which allow us to load the gif directly in our application uh, many people don't know about the many libraries which we can directly access the file of that library and load uh, a specific functionality in our application similarly like this so we only have to just let let see the uses of this file so we have to create one uh, image view and uh, just simply image view dot load gif and we have to pass the name of the gif so let's look how we can do that so the link of this repository was in description so go there and uh, uh, open this swift gif common folder and in this you will get a ui image plus gif.swift file i have already downloaded this file so i am not going to download this file and for one uh, for showing a gif you have to download one uh, gif image which i have al already downloaded this image so let's look how we can perform this thing let's drag and drop the downloaded file in our application Be sure that it should be copy item if needed and create uh, it doesn't matter the only thing matters is copy item if needed. So click on finish and it will copy this file in our application and the second thing which we needed is uh, the GIF image. So first let's design something just one image view and give the height and width according to your requirement I'm just fitting this thing in center with a specific height and it should be center horizontally and vertically so now let's do this uh, view controller and create the outlet of this GIF we already see that how we can use this GIF So I just created the outlet of this GIF, uh, this image view. Now uh, we have we, we need to one we need to have one GIF. So I've also already downloaded that GIF as well. So this is a GIF image. We have to place this GIF outside the asset folder. The be sure that it should be copy item if needed and create folder reference and it should be added in the target of GIF loader image. Let's finish this thing. Now, now we have to do some coding and that is it's an extension of image view. So uh, it will directly access over there by using image name, image view name, GIF image view dot load gif and in this we have to simply pass the name of that gif and the name of the gif is 
जी आई एफ वन सिंपली द नेम ऑफ द जी आई एफ समथिंग लाइक दिस नाउ लेट्स रन एंड लुक इज इट वर्किंग और नॉट it's not showing any image and it's saying that uh, we got this uh, debugger error that uh, uh, this image name gif1 does not exist but we have this image but it's saying it does not exist because we didn't add this thing in our target so we have to add this thing in a target membership so as i click on this now let's run this thing again it's still showing that it's not having in our target i think it's a i which is capitalized so i have to capitalize this thing i now let's run again yeah now it's loading and it's perfectly showing the only thing which is left is it's a black background so let's make it black and run, run again so it's now looking cool with a small uh, with a little gif is loading in our application yeah it's looking good by using this functionality we are going to create our custom loader something like this and uh, this is a this is created uh, purely from programming not any drag uh, and drag and drop thing so uh, so th this loader can be uh, placed on any view controller not repeating uh, that view again and again because it's created by using programming so please don't forget to watch out this uh, custom loader uh, video which is my next video uh, if you like my videos please don't forget to subscribe my channel uh, and don't forget to comment below on the channel and if any suggestion they are welcomed uh, thank you so much